The Setter Cougars finished the regular season in second place in the Pioneer Valley League behind Marysville. The Cougars begin the section playoffs drawing the eighth seed in Division Three. Senior James Cook Jr. led the Cougars in scoring all season long. Center also has a sophomore doing really well this year. His name is Jeremiah Butler. The eight seeded Cougars taking on the nine seeded Lincoln Fighting Zebras. Senior Jake Overbay is putting up over 17 points a game for Lincoln, while junior Benny Jomo is averaging around 15 points a game. Lincoln traveling to Antelope to take on center Friday night. Nick Pecorero here with a Friday night Division Three opener between the number eight center Cougars and number nine Lincoln Fighting Zebras. Here we go, first quarter, Benny Jomo gets the Zebras going with a strong drive to the rack, but center answers right back as sophomore Jeremiah Butler takes his defender to spin class and goes hard to the hoop. Butler again, this time on defense, he looks up and finds Edward Powell under the hoop for an easy bucket, and then Powell working from the top of the key with the Troy Palomalu hairstyle, never not working. Center goes on an 8-1 run, and then Tim Koriaka finds James Cook in the corner who puts on his chef's hat and sprinkles in a tray right here to close out the first half up 31-25. Boy, this Cougar team can shoot. Third quarter, Alex McCord takes over for a bit. He drains a three here, and this is not an instant replay. McCord says, thank you, sir. May I have another? Center up 13 in the third, but we've got a zebra sighting. Jake Overbay steps into the lane for a pull-up J, and then Chase Ferguson in grand pursuit of a loose ball here. He gets the floater to go, and then Marco Bales splits a pair of Cougars to help the Zebras fight back into this game. They're down just four heading into the fourth, and then Overbay gives them a one-point lead with this three, but the Cougs went unbeaten at home in the regular season. They were out to protect their house. Cook gets the put back and then finishes with the fast break. He had 16 points and 13 rebounds to lead center into Monday's Division III quarterfinal. Our first quarter was rocky, but once we locked in, we, we, we got on track, we started making our runs, and I feel like that's how we closed out the game. We miss out on that opportunity, these close games where you, you just get that nervous feeling in your stomach, but I feel like we're, we're prepared for it. You know, we missed out on a junior season, but we're ready now. We're ready senior year. 